get the name again. Kana. Okay. Kana. Oh, nga naman. Wala kang ginagawa. Isa mga mo na yung bata. <laughs> Pinaalala ba? <laughs> Aray ko! Sa akin na si Sukuho pa namin yung baka na. Minendang out yung bata. Tarantana talaga to si Sukuho. <laughs> That's how desperate Miko to is when it comes to her boobs. <laughs> Final five episodes of season three have begun. Oi! Mas marunong ba ako kumain ng ramen sa iyo? Mas marunong kumain ng ramen? heard the word Tamashi in Yu-Gi-Oh! Yugi 5 Ds because <laughs> Jack, Al- Jack Atlas always uses that to uh, to introduce Red Deem- uh, to introduce Red Dragon Archie. Oh, Kaya pala. Sakit sa ulong Hesper yan si, si Mitori. Mayroon pa si Shirai niya no? during, the, during the first arc. Nakilala si Miko to. Sikat siya eh. Sikat na Esper. Patrolam din siya kung huwingi siya eh. Ano ba mga to? Nice face mask. First school, now scavenger. Who's next? There were no fight scenes. No fight scenes in the camp, but just the um... What we can call a briefing episode, you see? They have... The characters have briefed each other when it comes uh, about the about the subject. Who is, uh... Si Kiri Barriojo. Oh, that's Kuri Barriojo. So let's just call her Ryojo. Cyborg that has uh, the cyborg that can be in two places at once. You know, your human half has to be put onto a machine in in the place of the lo- of your lost parts. Makina na ang kapalit. So wow, okay. You can be in two places at once in this setup. Your machine hub is somewhere, well, right here. Your machine is now somewhere wreaking havoc, uh, maiming people, <laughs> maiming regular people, while you are in your in your condo unit, uh, minding your own business. Because that's how uh, Mikoto and Shukuo uh, found the real Ryoko. That concept is rather creepy and deadly. Imagine being in two places at once. Now I don't know kung uh, concurrent ang mindset ng ng dalawang Ryoko or uh, one knows the movements of the other. One knows uh, what the other's thinking. Uh, I don't know kasi wala pa na reveal dito. Eh. All that we know now. From this episode, is that there are two Ryokos. One half of the other. So, well, Tawaro Aga on the Real Gun Season 3, Episode 21. One top up lang. <clears throat> I was hell bent on giving this episode the two thumbs up. 
<coughs> from the get go. Natawa ako talaga sa when they uh, Rick, when they we called some parts of the uh, of the press check episode that I called. I forgot the episode number. Par tagana ni. So <coughs> doon pa lang bibigyan ng bibigyan ko na sana ng two thumbs up eh, but as the episode went by okay, briefing, briefing and the only uh, the only piece of action that we got here was Nikotos uh, well, this, Nikotos field break in hindi natuloy yun kasi eh, tumakas yung ano eh tumakas yung machinery ho ko eh as you could see in the eh, as you may have may have seen in the episode tumakas eh naunahan na siya eh so hindi na niya matut- hindi na matutuloy yung uh, yung break in niya again one thumb up for episode 21 I was hoping to I was actually hoping to get a fight scene here alright because <clears throat> because it's uh, episode 21 already okay we're now counting down to the last five episodes of season 3 so it's gonna be it should be uh should be dapat dapat dito pa lang medyo ano na eh medyo girian na eh dapat dito pa lang nagigirian na eh so yeah I can only give it one thumb up right I hope in episode 22 magkakaroon na ng fight scenes or talagang girian o angasan man lang angasan man lang right so, uh, well I'm sure Sure, the animators have, uh, have already planned that. So let's so let's just watch. It, okay? Let's just watch. It. When it comes to eating ramen, if you solid sa mga mo, use the chopsticks. When you're going to drink the soup, use the spoon or the ladle. Ilang, ilang naman yun eh. To make your ramen eating, to make your ramen experience more pleasurable. All right, power tip po sa inyo mga ka lifestyle. Clarification. Apare Ranman is a PA Works original. Okay, not Kadukawa, sorry. It's a PA Works original. Oh? Oh. Brisman is quitting? Ah, kaya pala short break ang title ng episode. Dylan has a soft side. You're useless to me. Yes! Two engines in parallel. That's the basic concept of the hybrid engine. Hello! Parang hindi ka engineer Carter eh! Oh, 
Ang hindi na alaman. Si Rao na talagang siya pa rin. Aray. What's that, Thomas Edison? Holy shit! Insane work ethic in all of anime right now. Apare Sorano. Una. Una hybrid engine. Oh. Oh, maybe na balak si Chris P. A. To. Looks like Griezmann is. Looks like Griezmann is hiding skeletons in his closet. If you ask me. Wow. Another plot twist that is unexpected. That is unexpected. So that's how the episode ended. Apare Ranman episode 9. Even though the race temporarily stopped, two thumbs up. It was a fun, it was, overall, it was a fun episode to watch. Especially, especially, okay, these things. These were, these were, uh, these were the points. These are the points in this episode that made me give, made me give it the two, made me give, give, where? Give this episode the two thumbs up. Uh, the drinking match, uh, okay, and Apare stock walking. Talaga natawa ako. <clears throat> natawa ako talaga sa dalawang, uh, dalawang sequences na to. Okay, especially Apare stock walking. My God, it, wow, it made me laugh my ass. Off, all right. So, Mariano, how how could someone um, spend the whole day walking around town aimlessly while thinking while thinking about his car, of how to improve his car, all right? And not <clears throat> and not happening anything adverse to him. Wala masamang nangyari sa kanya all throughout. Okay, this is. This is the irony of this is the irony of of it all. Apart from stop walking, nothing serious happened to him. Okay, uh, we we all saw he stepped on a bucket. He ran through he ran through Thomas Edison's house. Okay, he ran through Thomas Edison's house, and without even knowing that that the man he uh, uh, that the man of the house was there, Thomas Edison himself. And he didn't know. He just, he just got up and back to think, went back to thinking again. He even, uh, what you call this? As like I said before, he even, he even rode a donkey without even knowing. My God! How? How? How insane? How insane your work? Can your work ethic be? Can a normal person's work ethic be? All right? This is the most insane work ethic I have seen in I have seen in an anime. Okay, <clears throat> this is probably the main reason why I gave it the two thumbs up. Okay, this episode of Aparelan Man. Although there were no there were no cart there were no racing sequences here. Nope. It was just a uh, wind down episode, but it was fun to watch. It was fucking fun to watch. So again. Apare Ranman episode 9 Two thumbs up Probably the craziest episode of this show Okay, episode 9 If you want to um, Well uh, What's called this If you If I would If I would recommend Apare Ranman I would have um, I would have that person watch episode 9 first The to, to give him an idea of how zany this show is. Okay, how crazy this show can get. <clears throat> so, yun nga. And by the way, Apare Ranman is uh, slated for uh, I think 13 episodes. So, the, the countdown to, the fi- to its final 5 episodes has begun with this one. Episode 9. 10, 11, 12, 13. Tama. 
So we're now down to So we're now down to just uh, the final four episodes. Nakita naman natin na sa teaser. The title of the episode, the title of episode 10, The Bridge to Hell. Okay. So, things will things will certainly heat up from from here on end. And if you think um, the hostage situation in the last episode was uh, to top it all off, nope. Far from it. I believe it's far from it. So we better we, we better keep our eyes glued to the to the to the last four episodes, the final four episodes of this show. And wow, episode nine blew my mind. It made me laugh my ass off. And well, <clears throat> another life lesson learned. Another life lesson learned. Of all things from an anime. Start there.
ng mga gauge ng metro. Hindi na nakayanan. Hindi <coughs> nila alam yung ginawaan nila. Grabe kayo. In the anime, it's called Age Friend. In real life, it's called Friends with Benefits. Kulwari pa kayo. <laughs> Friends with Benefits, ang tawag sa inyo. So, yun ang, uh, yun ang gusto niyang mangyari sa kanilang dalawa ni Enjo. Kasi, <clears throat> Enjo was actually the first one to beat her in a, uh, in a zero game. Okay, kumbaga, like, it's like, it's a lot like, um, uh, yun, si Peter Grill, parang ganon. Because the champ, Alam nyo natin lahat, Peter Grill becomes a champion of a tournament and suddenly becomes, he is now a judge, is the world's, the world's strongest warrior. So lahat ng mga babae, gusto kumabit sa kanya. Ganito rin dito sa episode na to. Alright? I just want you guys to watch this episode because I don't want to spoil anything regarding this, this, uh, this part of the episode. You really need to watch it. All I can say is, uh, they were absolutely lewd after this. Okay. Super he- Super Hexeros made me laugh my ass off again. <clears throat> there were no fight scenes, okay? There were no fight scenes here. There were no um, there were no battle scenes with the enemy. Just <clears throat> them <clears throat> and their desperate uh, and their, and their and their desperate ways of um, upping their H energy before the big uh, the big battle comes along. The big war comes along. Wow, okay. What a way for Super Hexeros to come back. With this episode. <clears throat> Hindi kagad ano eh. Hindi kagad nag uh, battle scene. Just uh, interactions between uh, between the characters concerned. Especially si Shiko. She's starting to become she wants to be she wants to be really close with uh, with Enjo. Alright? So, ano naman? Well, you know Hoshino and her dark conscience. Hindi magpapatalo. Right, so our rivalry has just begun, okay? <clears throat> Which spices up this show even more. So, Super Hexeros, episode eight, two thumbs up. <clears throat> I like that rivalry between uh, the rivalry that started between Hoshino and uh, Shigo, right? <clears throat> Dalawa magkaibang branch to, pero isang isang nalaki ang gusto, isang nalaki. They're fighting over a guy, which is Enjo. Okay, so it's it. Wow, their <clears throat> if their rivalry is this funny, I'm going to regret not watching a single episode from now on. <laughs> I'm not gonna. I am going to regret not watching a single episode from now on. Cause eh, ano ne? I believe we're, we're down to the last. Yeah, five episodes. So we're down to episode episode 8 is done. So 9 to 12 na lang. Uh, <clears throat> so we're we ne- Super Hexeros is also nearing its end because well, they have to finish it because the anime season is over. The uh, summer 2020 is about to end and more new an- more anime more new animes are now coming in. So they got they got to end this. So they have to end this part. This uh this this anime to give way to the new ones. So, yeah. <clears throat> this episode made me laugh my ass off. Especially that rivalry, alright? Holy shit. I've never seen a, um, a love triangle as it takes as this. Okay? Um, anime or live action? Nope. This one takes the cake. So again, Super Hexeros Episode 8, two thumbs up. <laughs> two thumbs up. It's a good way to uh, uh, Super Hexeros uh, came back in a big way with for me. The anime came back in a big way with this uh with, with episode 8. I said last time recap episode today. And of course I wasn't able to review this right away because uh, I had to I had to uh, put up a strict schedule of reviewing. <clears throat> so, if you're gonna see this, this this was last week's episode. But I strongly encourage everybody to watch the latest episode. All right, keep informed. Right, keep informed. But 
Don't give me the spoilers, all right? Don't give me the spoil. Don't give me spoilers, okay? So I'll see you in the next episode, guys. Nalalaman. Episode. So, I'm gonna, I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep this long. All right, I'm gonna keep this long. Peter Grill and the Philosopher's Time, two thumbs up. <laughs> We're down to the final four episodes. Okay, we're now down to the final four episodes. It means Peter Grill is about to come to an end. And as you've seen in the teaser, well. I think Peter's problems will are gonna get magnified. All right, there's a little, uh, there's a little um, silhouette. There's a character that was silhouetted, but uh, I bet. Uh, okay, I am very sure. Yun ang tatay ng magkapatid na ogre. <laughs> Yun ang tatay nila. So it's gonna complicate things even further. All right, it's gonna complicate things even further, making it. Probably even more fun to watch than this episode. Okay. Peter Grill, uh, here's, uh, here's another observation. Here's another observation on this anime. Peter Grill has that knack. Okay. This anime, the Peter Grill anime has that knack of one upping itself episode by episode. That's what I've been. That's what I've been. Uh, that's what I've been noticing in this entire anime. This entire anime the whole time. So, wow. I don't care if other uh, if if other if 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 normies call this a hentai, ah, 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 you don't know what a hentai actually looks like. Um, Peter Grill is just borderline. Okay, Peter Peter Grill is just borderline. So with that, um, again with with wow, with the uh, Peter Grillish funny moments. All right. Again, Peter Grill and the Philosopher's Time. Two thumbs up. <laughs> so, well, I don't want to wait for the next episode. I don't want to um, call this. Wait for the next episode. And, well, uh, as, as you have noticed, I am reviewing episode 8. In case you're not uh, following this, following the episode reviews, that, following the ERD, Episode reviews digest. That's the acronym. Okay. If you haven't, uh, if you're not up to speed, go watch, uh, go watch the last episode, uh, right here, right in the card. All right, right here in the card. You can go watch the last episode for my explanation on why I, uh, why I took a break from reviewing this anime. Right. Actually, this is this isn't the only anime that I took a break from reviewing. There are three others. The next, 
actually the next three animes that I did not uh, that I did not review last week will be coming up so keep on watching All right again Peter Grill of the Philosopher's Time two thumbs up Spelled backwards is Seto. episode <clears throat> it's here mas pinokos may tao sa loob wow <laughs> may tao sa loob could this be the the main villain si Roa ba eh parang panghimagas lang na villain right is Roa the uh, what's it called this uh, will Roa be uh, just just another dueling villain at may at may mas tuso, may mas masama pang susunod sa kanya. 
Well, by the looks of it, mukhanga. <laughs> it's more likely. It is more fucking likely. So, I couldn't wait for the next episode, alright? After 13 episodes, you know what? After the first uh, two or three episodes, many have given up on this show. But, as of Last six, the last five or six episodes, the ratings have picked up, uh, as I heard. Right, as I've heard, the, la- the the ratings have picked up. So that means, may mga panibagong fans na ang show na to sa, sa Japan. <clears throat> and episode 13, wow, it's uh, this do well actually. These two episodes, episode 12 and 13, to me they're fan service episodes. Okay, episode 12. You saw Card Destruction, I showed you my copy of Card Destruction. Here in episode 13, we now know the name of that uh, of that tall guy who sees blue eyes. His name is Otis. If you would notice his name, spell it backwards. It will say Seto. Great Ome oh, Seto Kaiba. Total! Otis used Blue Eyes White Dragon against Yuga in episode 1. Para lang uh, to well, para may labas ang ang bagsik ng Rush Duel format. It pays homage to Seto Kaiba. Pinaligtad yung pinaligtad lang yung pangalan from Seto to Otis. But we have uh, we also found out. We also found out in this episode that kaya pa lang no one no wonder. Otis has this uh, sort of uh, control over Goha systems. Did you notice that? Tin tinawagan pa rin niya si si Mimi, who is now dressed as a Goha as a Goha executive. One of the she's one of the six yata. Eh. She's one of the six uh, senior level. So so nung sa pinaka boss. So he has that kind of leverage. But everyone is wondering. Now we know. He is one of the executives, but probably no one knows what is who he really is. So anyway, so yung pala, he's he is a Goha executive. Siguro, maybe he's he, maybe he's a top level executive. Maybe he's a top level like, top level exec like uh, like Mimi. Pero you seen it. The top level executives all have their faces covered except their mouths. So their identities their identities are totally secret. The only one who probably knows their secret their their true identities is the head itself. Yung pinaka boss nila. And kaya pala. Kaya pala ganun. Ganun kaluwag ang access niya sa database ng Doha. He was able he was able to uh, to unhack uh, to unhack uh, yung pinagawa ni Roa dun sa, data, sa database. Kumbaga, uh, dinilip temporarily ang information about Seven Soul Magician para lumabas na it's a legal guard. Okay? That's one of the things we found out here. Talagang wow. It's a grand screw job by Roa. Right from the very beginning, he wants to screw Yuga. And he went to he went to he went that he went that far. It was to erase the information on Seven's Road Magician. To fit this a database on Goha. This will have repercussions. Goha might hunt him down for this. He rectify me. He rectify me Otis. Pira balik yung, yung information. Inon hack niya. So, then, after, then, after you go on, yun nga, uh, naglaho na lang si Otis uli. That's how, that's how exciting it was. And there's a new EV. Woo, finally! And it rocks. Okay? It rocks. Ginamit din insert yun eh. Yung EV. When Roa summoned his ace, ginamit din, niya, ginamit din yun. But I think that will be the official EV na. 
or sevens. Talagang pinalitan na nila. Unless, unless yun ang gawin nilang OP sa next, ano, sa next arc. I mean, would that be cool? Alright. But, siguro easy lang. I'm, I'm hung, uh, what? I've gotten used to na 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 already. <laughs> and the single is about to release in, uh, it's about to be released in Japan in September. So, okay lang. Okay lang kung yung pa rin ang OP. Okay, Seiki, Seiki, Seiki UK. Yu-Gi-Oh! 7th, episode 13. Two thumbs up. Just watch episode 13, mga ka-lifestyle. I didn't get into too much details right now, but uh, I am very excited for the next episode. We just ended... Yu-Gi-Oh! 7 just ended an arc with this episode. Oh, Mori is such a cute kid. He's a cute kid. He's a cute kid. Is that a chariot? It's a big one. Not usually into techno, but it's okay. Oh no, you're going to deport. They have teamwork. They're going to be a big deal. Why is he dressed for a swimming tournament? He's going to be a big deal, Michael Phelps. Pings yan. Mas no pressure. Pings yan. Mas no pressure. Swordless. The move she used in, ano, in episode... Four. Malik sa kanya. Pusa. Laki sabog ah. He can multiply himself. Punta si naksak. Naksak si Moser. Mira. Sabi lang sa... This girl's a fucking masochist. Yeah. Na ako pa lang alin si Tayo ni. Tangi Pasarito. Kawawa si Mina rito. She's having an out-of-body experience. Whoa! Ano to? Lubuting siya. Lubuting siya. Laki na puputol. Number 4 dito! Chan Waji.
Shariok is what uh, uh, what is to God of High School. Uh, how, do, how do I describe this? Um, uh, how do I say this? Parang ano ko nito? Um, a Shariok in God of High School is like a stand in JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. Kano? There's a JoJo reference in God of High School. I still love it. He looks pissed. Hey, Mori. Tang. Tang ina mo. Oh, ta. Oni ginawa niya sa sa una. Hindi na ginawa niya rito. Oh, tang ina mo. Lumabas na pagkatimono ni Mori! Tang ina ang pinagwagwagan! No Dragon Kick! Hindi namin siya kay Daiwi nun! Kaya nangyari ka dyan! Oh! Ta! Nakatayo ka pa rin ha! Puto na ginagawa ka na! I just gotta see this again! Taka lang, dalawang dragon! Yung pinakamala sa kalaban! Nakilakilain ang isa! Mayari-yari rito yung kalaban niya! Lumas na pagka-demonyo ni Mori! Holy shit! she is going to die here. Ito nga si Mori. Oh my God, twin blue dragon kick! And, and to think that, and to think that uh, everybody needs a chariot. No, nope, not Mori. <laughs> Taragis na yan. Wow! Okay. This is so far the craziest episode of this anime. Wow! Okay. So, if you haven't seen God of High School, I strongly suggest, what? I strongly suggest you watch episode 9 first. <laughs> Para malaman mo kung gano ka kapagsik ang anime na to. Oh my God. Wow. Simply wow. Right? Talagang talk about, uh, talk about in the time of week. Tataan yung kinalan ni Mira yung kalaban yung dun na dumating dum- 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 si Mori. God. Okay, the episode is well written. Okay. The episode is well written, and the um, the 
emotional roller coaster ride. Woo! Teka nga, kakain na naman ng tubig. Woo! Emotional roller coaster ride. On this episode, put me to for the second time. Wow. This episode authenticates the, uh, how, uh, how good Calabite food is. So, Calabite food episode 9. Oh, thumbs up. <laughs> Two fucking thumbs up and a big toe. Like that. Yeah, and a big toe. <laughs> member of the city. Looks like the tiger has raised another tiger. Nope. Bonnie did not look like a tiger here. He looked like a demon. Lumabas ang pagkatibon yun yung Bonnie dito. He took out two opponents in the same, two powerful members of Nox in the same day. Or within, probably within the same hour. Shit! What's that in the Okay, let me recollect myself again for repeating this, repeating the rating. God of High School Episode 9, two thumbs up. So, let's just watch, let's just wait for the next episode. Wow. Alatang, ano ne, alatang patakos lang God of High School because Episode 9 starts the, uh, starts the road to the finale. Well, uh, starts the road to, the, to this anime's finale. They find last five episodes in it. So we're now down to just um <coughs> excuse me. We're now down to just four episodes. Kapit lang mga lifestyle. Kapit lang sa God of High School. Holy shit! I'm gonna take a break. Okay? I'm gonna take a break. yung naging MP ng last episode. Baka nakapremonation na pala si, ano, si Yurika. Ang Katyn interviewed her. This is where the, this is where the last episode ended. Siya pa! Nakita na ng iba. Sino huli ka niya na? Ni Kendro ko. Ah, na, lalim yan. Observa nila ngayon for, ano, for the next 24 hours si, si Doc Yuri ka. So, yung pala mga lizard, yung mga lizard types, uh, lizard type na GB, ah. yung pala parang may sting at ng Scorpio, yung tanky na. Combination ng, ano, Gekko at Scorpion. GBX. Pastado si ano? Pastado si Sensu eh. For the second time, he falls in. Yo, kinojo naman ang nakapag-take it to Yuri ka. Oh, wala. Nawala. Wala na nawala. Wala. Oh, mal- hindi na malaki ni Yugi Roger na. Wala na si Doc Yuri na. Don't die. <laughs> 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 
sa laki niya niyan. He doesn't have the strength of a hundred men. <laughs> that hulk of a monk? Who never thought he's a monk? Huwag gabi niya. Doon pa lang tatago. Malapit na yan. Malapit na siya. Tanginang yan. Kombinasyon ng gecko talaga at scorpion. Nojo actual act actually sacrificing his uh, sacrificing his own life just to just to preserve both Kathleen and Sensui. You can't you can't ask someone to do to do something like that anymore. Only an enemy will you see such uh, such heroics. So, uh, well, we we've, we've seen in previous episodes what Yuki Nojo can do. That huge, that huge club of his, talagang pagera yun eh. Pagera actually, yung club niya nun. You can, uh, you can, you can, you can crack someone's skull open with that one. Uh, much, much more a GBS skull. May nakita nila, may, may mga, ano eh, may mga magtatago na kasi, pa ano eh, pa, pa umaga na. So, lumalabas na yung araw. Doon, takot, doon kasi takot ang mga GB ah. Sa liwanag. <coughs> they saw Yuki Nojo. They, they thought, Uy, muling kain bago, bago matulog. So, yeah. Uh, uh, Tok Yurika also left a message for her daughter. Yeah, medyo, uh, uh, all this. Dito eh. feel mo na feel ko yung uh, na feel ko yung pagkananay niya doon. Si Tokyo Rika. Na feel ko yung pagkananay niya doon. And um yeah, um uh, how will the group survive now? Okay. Um Tokyo well, let's assume now that um, 
Tok Yurika is gone. Magiging GB na siya dito. And they're scrounging for supplies. Sensui is still down. And um, Yuki Nojo had to, had to do the right. Had no choice but to uh, defend the cap all by himself. Uh, uh, he shoves uh, he he shoves Kathleen out of the picture para kasi hindi pa, hindi pa kaya ni Kathleen hindi pa kaya talaga eh. she's yet to receive uh, formal fighting training from any of those four uh, okay. so, a lot of drama uh, it's a bit tough to watch kasi we lost another important character Probably you cannot make the ultimate sacrifice. Only the new epi- only the next episode will tell. Talaga. But it's you cannot do more than one episode. So um, yeah, uh, it's um, typical of an apocalyptic anime. It's typical of an apocalypse anime. GB8 episode 8 Who comes up? Right? The drama uh, It's not corny I was thinking Affected ako eh <laughs> Medyo affected ako kanina Kaya uh, You didn't see uh, You didn't see much reaction from me You didn't see much reaction from me okay, I was I was uh, I was dumb silent About uh, what went on in this episode So Talaga Hey, don't get me wrong, okay? Hindi porket timing ko din almost the entire episode. Eh. The episode is bad. Nope. Far from it. It was a it was a very good episode. It was a fucking good episode. Yeah, I am looking forward to uh, I'll be looking forward absolutely to the next episode. Eh. Episode 8 na. So we're now down to just the final four. Kasi na yung countdown to the finale dito sa episode na to. So, um, mga ka-lifestyle, you, you should watch GB. Right? If you think uh, uh, Apocalypse anime or uh, that sub-genre is done, nope. Far from it. GB just uh, GB is slowly putting uh, putting that sub-genre back into the not exactly uh, not exactly the way High School of the Dead did it six years ago no uh, we've yet to see that we've yet to see that happen kasi uh, there's there's four episodes left so again GB8 episode 8 two thumbs up so, wow <clears throat> I tell you the drama is for me right because all the characters here are really all the characters here, not just the lead, not just the lead character, even the villains. Okay, strangely enough. So let's just wait for the for the next episode, shall we? Let's just wait for the next episode. Hang, hang in there, mga uh, mga ka lifestyle. Just hang tight, to guys. Here we go. Decadence episode 9. Dami galon. Decadence is now down to just down to just 5 episodes. Starting from this. Got all genocide system. You wanna be the on GGS? I don't know. A force shield. The shit's stuck in the phone, the circuits. 
So, doon yung ano, yung tayo ng gadol. The puke fest has begun! <laughs> It's a puke fest! Gadol tanks can, cannot take their own shit. <laughs> so, yung... Yung tain nila, naririlig niya sa tubig. E doon sila nakatiri. Napupulot na. Nako, buta. Nakatulugan na sila. Milk fest. Sino yun? Sino kaya yun? Punta. Punta. Talk to one idiot. Na ako, nahuli sila. Jill. You're totally useless. Politika nito. Buntot lang. Ulul. Don't let me stop you. Tinapon siya dun. Sa mixer. Kinalo lahat ni Donatello. At ang game police. Ay puta. Tatapo na lang ano. Ginawa niya medyo yung sarili niya. No, he's not! Ooh! Ooh, taragis! Sag just look the place. Eat shit, boys! <laughs> Gigi-eta sila. Two-man kill switch pala yan. Gigi-eta. Nakamamatay na siya. Nakamamatay na eh. Nagda-die off na lahat. Ang kontang nila. Wow! <laughs> Grabe! Episode 9. Shit. I never thought, um, uh, what's it called? It's a revolution would be staged this way. Okay. In an, at least in an anime. So, akala ko tuloy yun ang matatalo yung mga video eh, because of these two sellouts. Yung pala, Turkey, yun nga, Turkey, Uh, loyal to the system. Okay. To the system. Si Sark naman, he just redeemed himself by blowing himself up in that, uh, that, that in that pile of gadol shit na, that went nuclear. <laughs> so, naging successful ang plano. The gadol are no more. Tapos, uh, medyo naguluhan nga si kanina, si Natsume. Sinabi, sinabi na ni Murage ang buong katotohanan. Everything here is manufactured. That's, as you see, that's 
for the episode ending. Wow! Wow! Okay. Talk about um what's it called this? Talk about uh, starting the road to the finale with a bang. Okay. Alalahan niyo. Episode 9 is the start of the last five episodes. Kasi Decadence is slated for slated for 13 episodes. So the last five starts at episode 9. Grabe. Na, natawa ako dun sana eh. Although na I felt pity for I felt pity for their masters and of course the game to him. Yung the puke fest <laughs> nung pinasabog nila yung yung etching ng gadol. That was both exciting and funny to watch. Okay. The Puke Fest has begun, sabi ko nga kanina. Wow. Okay. So, ang tanong, what will episode 10 look like? Now that there are no more gadol whatsoever. Wala na. So, the rat race has been cut. Okay. The rat race has been cut severely. Has been severed. What happens now in the next episode? Well, we'll just have to stick around. We'll just have to stick around. So, Decadence Episode 9. Two thumbs up. <clears throat> wow. Decadence has been... Uh, has been astounding me for six straight weeks now. So, hands off to the end. Hands off to, again, to Studio Nut. For putting out, uh, I think... One of the best original animes this year. Talagang, hands down, it's one of the best. One of the best uh, original animes this year. Probably next to... Nope. Uh, I think... This and Aparilanman are the best. Yan, yung dalawang yan. Decadence saka Aparilanman. Tandaan nyo, Aparilanman is also a studio original. TA Works developed that. Original din ito. Wow. It's heating up. Na ilan na siya may heating up. Parang, uh, may, parang may tinapos na silang art dito. Sa uh, Decadence. Kasi, uh, Natsume and Kaburagi were successful in, in turning on the, uh, turning on that kill switch. Yung GGS. So, two man kill switch pala siya. Kailangan, sabay nila dapat ibaba yung, yung switch. Yeah, two months with you. So, they were successful. All the gadol, naglaho na parang bula. So, I really want to see what happens now. What happens now? Kasi wala lang, ano, wala lang gadol. Eh. So, again, Decadence Episode 9, two thumbs up. Now, <clears throat> sorry about this one kasi... Uh, naputol yung internet connection ko sa stream ko sa, t- sa Twitch so I am uh, I am adding this one to kumbaga ikakabi ko to dun sa live stream right now uh, talagang uh, gumagaling connection ko so, I had to I had to uh, carry on by pre-recording this one so yeah let's just wait for the next episode shall we okay mga ka-lifestyle Please watch Decadence. Okay? It's worth your time. Alright? It's worth your time. Please watch animes like Decadence, uh, uh, Apare Ranman, and uh, of course the Manwas. They're giving, uh, they're a breath of fresh air when it comes to anime. Oh, 2020 is slowly shaping up to become probably one of the one of the one of the industry's best years despite coronavirus okay despite covid-19 ang dami mga ganang anime this ano this this summer pala this anime season pala ang dami na so keep on watching those new animes especially decadence okay especially decadence What's up, guys? I'd like to uh, first and foremost thank you for um, a 
appreciating the new uh, the new episode reviews format all right I decided to um, to lessen my talk and do more reacting so as you can see the, the you can see nearly all the reactions I uh, I had while watching a particular anime episode now just in case well just in case you're wondering why why I have the Twitch logo on the last three, well, it's simple. I intend to do live episode reviews on that platform. Okay? So, yung nakita ninyong tatlong episode reviews na yun, edited na yun. That is not the raw version. Okay? If you want to see the raw, unedited, unadulterated live stream versions of those episode reviews and future live reviews well all you have to do is follow me on twitch link in the description right there all right so it's been another week of great anime uh, great anime episodes all right although there will although the uh, the first four uh, the first uh, yeah, the first four are are now delayed because I well, like in the last digest, I told you that uh, I had I need to pace myself. So I'm glad that you still I'm glad that you guys are still here, and I hope to see you on Twitch, right, for the live episode reviews. Catch you later, my lifestyle.